outside the K-Wing locker room after a 2-1 loss with the Kalamazoo Wings. And Nick, the team played well all weekend long. I know you wanted nine periods of hockey. you got to be somewhat happy, but a disappointing third period allowing two goals. Yeah, I mean, we just uh, we let that team hang around. And, you know, a, a team that's as desperate as they are trying to get back on track, you know, um, they're going to throw everything they had at us tonight. And, you know, we had our opportunities in the second period on the power play where we could have finished it off. And I think the game would have ended in a different fashion. But, uh, you know, we kept it a, they kept it a one-goal game and sacrificed and found a way to get some momentum. And, you know, you can say all you want with a lucky bounce on the second goal, but it, it, it doesn't really matter. You know, the focus was that we had an opportunity to put them away and we didn't. Somewhat fitting the way this series went. Uh, 11 goals combined in the first game. K-Wings getting uh, an impromptu bounce to, to win it. K-Wings shut them down in the second. So we've seen two different styles of games. And tonight, just a, a different one as well. What's the takeaway getting uh, four of the six points this weekend? Yeah, I mean, you come on the road, and any time that uh, you can get those points that way, you're obviously excited for your hockey team. You know, it's tough to win. The parity in this league is uh, tremendous, and it's tough to win on the road. So, And then you play a team three consecutive times. It's always difficult to get that third. K Wings back on home on Wednesday. You guys start a three game homestand, and the Florida Everblades come to town. Yeah, I mean, we got some pretty hot teams coming to our building this week. You know, with Florida, obviously one of the top teams in our league, and um, that'll be a huge test for us uh, coming back to home. And you, you want to worry about that mental lapse, right? It, it seems like teams that come off the road that first 10 minutes or that first period, they struggle a little bit at home. Um, so that'll be something we'll be focusing on uh, after the game tonight and then throughout this uh, couple days of preparation. Hey, we'll talk to you on Wednesday night. Thank you.